I am at the base of an oak tree and it's about to rain but I wanted to get a quick video because there's something really cool here at the base of this oak tree. Sometimes you find it at the base of them, sometimes you'll find it up on the oaks, but usually not more than just a few feet up. This is a beefsteak mushroom. And it's a really cool one to know. Cut that off there and we can take a look inside. And um, it is a poured mushroom, so it's got pores on the fertile surface uh, and it's got kind of a marbled appearance when you slice it. This is a really fresh one, but when you slice it, it's got kind of a marbled appearance uh, like fresh meat. <clears throat> and this is one of the one of the few wild mushrooms that's generally eaten raw. It's actually got a lemony kind of zing to it. it Kathy has some good recipes uh, that, that she uses with this cooked, but a lot of people, like when it, when this goes to chefs from us, in general, they're slicing it thin uh, as a topping on some sort of a, a salad or a couscous kind of dish or something. But this is a, this is a really cool, cool one to know. Uh, beef steak, mushroom, uh, really not much else that this can be uh, confused with. Um, just due to the the appearance of it, the softness of it, uh, the interior, you get a faint, uh, faint kind of citrusy uh, odor. And when you cut it, it'll be really juicy. And like I said, it'll taste a little lemony. All right, here's this uh, beef steak that we got out in the woods back at home now. And I took a slice on it so that you can get a look inside. Um, kind of see hopefully what I was talking about about that sort of marbling in it uh, it's kind of cool you can um, actually see the pores there too